Money Watch is brought to you by Palmetto Citizens Federal Credit Union. Welcome to the February edition of Money Watch and very important topic this month. We're talking about fraud and identity fraud specifically, something that everyone that lives in South Carolina it's a real reality for. That's where we turn our attention now to Tim Young from our friends at Palmetto Citizens Federal Credit Union. And Tim, it's one of those things you never think can happen to you, but the reality is it has happened to us here in South Carolina. Yes, it is unfortunate, uh, but there are some things that consumers can do to protect their identity. The first thing being is to take advantage of the identity protection uh, that has been offered by the South Carolina Department of Revenue by enrolling in that free credit monitoring for the first year. It is a very quick five minute enrollment process that uh, you can do either online or mm -hmm. over the phone. Uh, it is uh, credit monitoring that you have access to as well as access to a fraud specialist if you should detect fraud on your account. Uh, the deadline is fast approaching on March 31st, 2013, so you want to make sure that you do meet that deadline. Um, and also, if you have dependents that were on your tax returns, you definitely want to enroll them in the family secure so that you can keep an eye on their credit as well. Let's talk about that deadline. What happens if I miss that deadline in March? There are things that consumers can do. They can place a fraud alert on their account. That fraud alert will last 90 days. Uh, you can renew it at will. Every 90 days you can keep renewing that fraud alert that is on your file. Uh, they can also place a credit freeze that will totally limit all access to their credit file. Uh, that cannot be removed until the consumer actually calls to uh, remove that from their credit file. All right, Tim Young from Palmetto Citizens Federal Credit Union. Helpful tips to keep yourself protected and the recent hacking that occurred for the South Carolina Department of Revenue. Of course, we'll have all this information on our website. Just head to MidlandsConnect.com and click on Money Watch.